So now let's see how we can work around with crossfade clips inside of Audacity. So in order to work around with crossfading of clips, I'm going to go around into file and then I'm going to go around into import and then audio. So I'm going to bring in two audio files right here. So this is one of the audio file and then I'm going to go around into import audio and then I'm going to bring in another audio file right here. So you can see that there's two audio files that I have. So I'm just going to go around and then delete off uh, different portions of the track right here. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go around onto the time shift tool, click and drag this, and then this is what you have, as you can see. So now I'm just going to go around and then if I were to go around and then zoom in, this is what I have. I can go around and then I can go to this click and drag it and there you go. So if I were to go around right here uh, on and then go on to my mouse cursor right here and press the uh, space bar. You can hear out that there's a quick change. But if you want to cross fade out between these two clips, you can go around onto the selection tool right here and then click and drag out the selection tool right here until how much you want to cross fade. So this um, like drag across the part where you want to cross fade and then you can go around into effect right here and you can see that cross fade clips is an option. So once you click on cross fade clips, what happens is that it's simply cross fade set. That's it. So if I were to press play button now, it slowly cross fades. So it starts from this. You can see that that is how you can cross fade between clips inside of Audacity. So if you guys learn something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.